everybody, welcome back. Welcome back to Cookmas, where I'm uploading a holiday theme recipe every single day this month from December 1st to the 25th. So today we're making some hot chocolate ornaments. So these are awesome as a gift or just something fun to have around your house on Christmas morning. This is actually a really solid hot chocolate recipe too. It's so creamy and delicious, so I know that you guys will absolutely love it. So let's get started. So first you want to cut the end off a piping bag large enough to fit into the opening of the ornaments. Stick the piping bag into the opening to act as a funnel. First, pour the confectioner's sugar into the ornament and jiggle the ornament slightly to flatten the surface. Repeat with the coffee creamer, some skim milk powder, and some cocoa powder. And if you like, if you prefer to have like a coconut flavor, you can use coconut powder instead of skim milk powder. And it's basically like coconut milk, so you'll get coconut hot chocolate, which I think is amazing. And also we have a little guest here. A little guest, because you were being noisy. Then you want to top with some mini marshmallow bits and seal the ornaments closed. Then you can add your desired toppings or flavorings. So for an extra chocolatey hot chocolate, you can add some mini chocolate chips or some sprinkles, some mini Reese's Pieces, which will make it taste like peanut butter hot chocolate, some salted caramel chips for caramel hot chocolate, and for the coconut hot chocolate, I also added some edible glitter to make it look super pretty in the ornament. Then hook the ornaments onto the trees with a string. And so you want to be careful when you're hooking them onto the tree. You want to make sure that the metal part is securely attached to the ornament. If it looks a bit iffy, be careful because they do have a bit of weight to them and it will be a catastrophe if they like detach and it falls off the tree and you get hot chocolate powder like everywhere. So um, maybe, um, so if you're not completely confident about their ability to stay sealed and closed, um, maybe just like hang them on the tree right before you're going to be like, presenting them and then it takes them off because uh, as I was hanging them I was like oh my god this could be the biggest mess especially because I have a little dog and I don't want him trying to eat the hot chocolate and then to make the hot chocolate empty one full ornament into a pot and add two cups of water and then just bring that to a boil and you'll have hot chocolate for two people or if you're like super super craving hot chocolate you'll have hot chocolate for you so yeah and you are done so thank you so much for watching. I hope that you like this recipe. Sorry about my voice. I'm getting a little sick, so <laughs> bear with me. Um, and I'm sorry for missing a couple days for Cookmas. Everything is getting filmed now, so I think I'm going to be having double the recipes on some days coming up soon, so I will let you guys know. Um, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you do want to get notified for when the next video goes live, you don't want to miss out, um, hit that subscribe button and ring the little notification bell. I'm so sick so that you get notified when the next video goes up. I love you guys so much. I hope you're enjoying my videos so far and I will see you tomorrow for a new video. Bye. Also, it's a little like present for you guys who have stayed this long. In a couple weeks, I'm going to be looking into getting a second Pomeranian and I think I'm going to be naming it Dumpling, I think. Do you guys think that's a cute name? Comment down below some dog name ideas. I want something cute, either like Dumpling or Pumpkin or Peanut or something like that. So let me know um, that you guys, so let me know if you have any like requests and then I'll know like who of you actually watched the end of the video. So, bye, wanna say goodbye? Wanna say goodbye? Are you ready to be a big brother? Are you ready to be a big brother? He has no idea. How can I like tell him? I want him to know. No idea.